Uh, my goal as the leader of this organization, if given the opportunity, is to make Grand Rapids Police Department the national gold standard for law enforcement and community police relations. That for not only this region, but the entire Midwest, that people will look, organizations will look, communities will look to this department and this community and want to imitate and mimic the, the efforts and advancements that we have made in community police partnership. So there are 23 allegations against the GRPD. And so there is a perception of racial bias. I also tell you that then perception is reality. It is someone's reality. My, my job is to ensure that that, that reality is addressed and, and how do I ensure that the policies and, and the directives of the organization aren't doing harm and aggravating the relationships with our community. Uh, and, and part of that is me engaging the community, our organization, our leadership team, engaging the community and providing understanding about or providing information so that citizens understand why we do what we do and in, in, in manner in which we do it. And, and then me looking at the way my officers are trained to ensure that, that the information and education that we're providing them isn't creating disparate impact to, to members of our community. And, and so whether it's real or perceived, it's a reality for the organization that, that there is an accusation of racial bias. And nothing can be more harmful than to the organization or to a person to be called a racist or anything that ends in IST. So, so I have an obligation not only to the community, but to the organization to ensure that our practices and policies aren't facilitating that type of policing.